Hi there, you are watching Dr. Green channel. Today we are going to continue uh, from the first part, which uh, today we are unboxing and also, also open the cover uh, on the back uh, to see the insides of this digital voltage stabilizer. So let's uh, see from the front uh, of this stabilizer. So that you, you can see this uh, two number, it, it keep uh, showing uh, the first one with the, with the dot and also the uh, without the dot. So the incoming voltage is dropped at 132 and this stabilizer helps to increase or adjust the voltage output uh, to be the 222 volt. Uh, so you can see the the light, uh, this light is now turn, turning on. So uh, this is the demo uh, that we are uh, showing the the voltage adjustment from this uh, digital voltage stabilizer okay so uh, from the front we are going to show you inside uh, so this we have uh, opened the cover of this stabilizer you can see the the transformer the round shape uh, white color over here so this is the the secret of this uh, rocket and also uh, very very uh, reliable. So uh, so yes, uh, this is the the transformer uh, which help to adjust the, the voltage and also uh, controlled by the controller, the microcontroller uh, working with the relay. So this will help to uh, automatically adjust which the step start from 10 volts uh, to 20, 24 volts and there are four relays together so uh, this can be uh, plus together or uh, reduce the number of relay to match with your uh, low or high incoming voltage so this is how uh, this work so it's automatically adjust and your output voltage will be uh, depends on the step that this relay uh, is working or switching uh, on and off to uh, trigger the the wire uh, inside this transformer okay so uh, on there are the, the main circuit breaker uh, on the back which I will show you shortly so let's see the back one right on the back, uh, you will see the, the terminal. There are two terminals uh, over here. So uh, you can see the on the right side is the stabilizer main circuit breaker. And on the left side over here is the bypass uh, main circuit breaker. Okay, and there are two terminals over here. So this is the, the incoming uh, AC main. So uh, if your home has the incoming uh, input from the from the grid so uh, we we'll connect to this side and tighten with uh, these screws okay and this is uh, on the right sorry on the left side uh, is the terminal to connect to the load so uh, this this cable we connect to to the load or your appliance or to the main circuit breaker Okay, so uh, you can see uh, there are the, the 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 Y cable for the line. Okay, neutral and ground. So both sides uh, for the incoming and outgoing, they are uh, the, the cable for the line, neutral and ground. So let's see uh, the the label uh, on each terminal. Okay, so uh, they are the the letters uh, mention or indicate okay for the terminal over here so you can see the the line earth and neutral and on this side on the terminal uh, on the left hand side here for the output also mention uh, neutral earth and line so this will help uh, you to to guide uh, the, the technician or uh, if you install by yourself so you can uh, connect the cable correctly 
and if uh, in the case you have like uh, wrongly uh, installed for the incoming and outgoing then uh, this stabilizer will not uh, work properly but uh, it will not damage so this is a uh, very good uh, which help uh, the customer uh, for the safety okay so <clears throat> this is the stabilizer main circuit breaker so if I off this okay you will see the the, the light uh, has been turned off and if I turn on this again so the light is on okay so this will uh, control the output of the stabilizer and for the left side uh, for the bypass it will use when the stabilizer have the problem or uh, the stabilizer is faulty so during you are waiting for the technician or the engineer to service uh, at your house so you can just turn the bypass on okay and turn the stabilizer off so it will uh, similar to uh, you connect uh, the the cable to the to the grid so uh, this will at least will help you to continue uh, using the the electricity in your house so uh, no need to uh, loosen the screw and then uh, connect the wire together like that so you, you don't need you don't need to do that just uh, turn this uh, stabilizer main circuit breaker off and then just uh, turn this on then you can uh, just continue using uh, the appliance in your house okay right then we are uh, showing you the the control board again so from the back uh, it it is more clear uh, this is the secret how and why we uh, the stabilizer is working very fast because uh, it is using the the microcontroller okay and the relay so you can see the relay the size is quite big and um, the capacity of each uh, relay is 40 ampere so uh, this is very very rugged and inside of this stabilizer you will not see any fan inside because uh, this has been designed uh, to use the natural cooling so this uh, make the stabilizer very very rugged because the fan is moving part so uh, we try to minimize the moving part as less as possible so this is the digital voltage uh, stabilizer from uh, Dr. Green okay all right so uh, let's let's see again for the for the front and the inside okay of this uh, stabilizer So if you have uh, any questions or the things uh, you want to see more, so uh, just leave your comments in this video and then we try to uh, answer or uh, shooting the other video to uh, clarify your questions or uh, your doubt after this. Alright, so please uh, stay tuned with us because in next session of the video, uh, we are going to uh, shooting the video for the for the solar and uh, the the application is for the uh, for the normal use uh, the in the appliance uh, in the house or the solar pump and also the the IOT things uh, the internet of things uh, which help you to see or uh, manage the thing from very far for example you have uh, your house in Bangkok and uh, you have the system uh, in in somewhere uh, in the provincial so you can you can see the status you can send the command to on and off or 
maybe uh, switch off or switch on the light or the the, the your sprinkle uh, okay and also to measure the the humidity uh, of the soil uh, whether you need to uh, give the water to the to your plants or not so uh, these are the the things that we are going to uh, share with you in next video so please stay tuned with us thank you for watching uh, dr green channel and see you next video thanks for watching again bye bye